the A1 spirit from Crusader. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. All right, smooth pilot. I want this to be a Kodak moment cinematic thing, okay? This is, might be my new intro for my video. So I want the best piloting skills when you go flying. She's a beautiful ship, all right. Shapely, seductive. I'm gonna fly her brains out. Yeah, you're gonna learn how to do this, but the first thing you want to do. I do you forgot, want Demar or Selen or? Doesn't matter. You're gonna pick it. You're gonna destroy it. Whatever. But while we're in warp, hit escape. Go to your key bindings. Go to advanced key bindings. Go to missiles. Go to. Key bindings, advanced control down at the bottom, key bindings, whatever. Go down to vehicle missiles, open that tab. Mm -hmm. When you get there, you see where T is? It should be on mm -hmm. uh, hold desired impact, right? Yeah. You want to erase that one and put it to the one above where you tap, not hold. Because when you hold it, it gets, it puts it on the ground, but then it goes away when you go away from it. You don't want that. You want it to permanently be on that ground until you lift it off. So put that one at impact point tap T, mega T or whatever button you got it set to. Then you should so, be fine. First on, I put it on tap T. Circle will be. But you gotta be close enough to see it. Okay. Uh, so, okay. Engaging bomb menu. And now I have to tap T. All you gotta do is tap it, it should put the target, the green circle should be on the ground when you tap it. Right now it's gonna be blue. So why don't you try hitting that crater right there? That's a perfect circle crater, unless you're going to some place. I, I, I don't see it. Just hit T. Target selection failed. That was not T, that was lights. It's both T and lights, because my lights are T too. Can't drop from any higher than 29,000 or 2,900. So you'd be moving across oh. the ground. Let's let's say you're just going across the ground. Just start flying. And just pick something random that you're going to try to target while you're flying. Go about 100, 150. Scroll your throttle down. That's a good target right there, that freaking thing we're flying over right now. That'd be perfect. Also help if we were in the daytime so you could see this stuff better. Yeah, I don't see much. Uh, so I would fly forward. Yeah, you would fly forward, and, and when you bomb. see that HUD in front of you, you would hit T, and it would put that on the, the target you want to hit. And then you would come back and do your flybys. With bombs. I'm going to stream it, because... Uh, I think you're not getting the vibe saver. Hey, I know what you're saying. It's probably different. Okay, do you see That's this? Your circle, yeah. As soon as I go up too much, it disappears, right? Yep. But how am I going to be flying? Well, all right, let's say you're going, like, right there. Right like, it there. says collision sure. alert right now, so I'm not high enough. You're you're high enough. You're actually way off the ground. All right, so let's say you got to use it like that. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to fly level until you get to your target. Then you're going to look down at them, hit T, and then take off real fast. Let's, let's say they're shooting at you. Well, you're going to fly fast. <clears throat> you're going to do a nose dip, look down, hit T, and target it, and then leave. So you got to use okay. Alt or Tab and T to make it stick, whatever you had it set to. Uh, we're going to get to that uh, outpost. I'm going to try to fly level here.
Could they have made this better? Yes. I believe once they introduced the bomb bay back there, the, uh, the engineering hood or whatever the heck that is, that's going to be a bomber thing. <clears throat> I believe that right there will probably help this problem with the bombers. Depending on how good you think you're going to be to dip the nose down, put the target on, and lift off. Oh no, you didn't drop the bomb. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Same as they were a year ago. 